Hey, we got some dope news wrapped up in one epic video. Let's go. What is going on, everybody? How are y'all doing? Before we get started, y'all already know the vibes. Give the stream a big thumbs up. PS5 console giveaway. That's right. That's why we're doing this video, too. And we got a couple of other dope news items. But we are having a PS5 console giveaway in October. It's going to be lit. Make sure you subscribe to the channel. Follow me on Twitter. Let's get to the news. Bro, a pretty big game has just, not pretty big, a huge game has just leaked online. Nether Realms, the creators of Mortal Kombat and Injustice Gods Among Us, the DC fighting game, is rumored to be coming out with a Marvel fighting game, bro. <laughs> Bro, this is coming from CBR.com. A rumor suggests that Mortal Kombat developer NetherRealm Studios is working on a Marvel fighting game that includes iconic and obscure characters. And they have Spider-Man in the article. Bro, they have a picture of Spider-Man. Uh, <laughs> bro, Spider-Man in a fighting game. That's, I mean, he's been in fighting games before, Marvel vs. Capcom, but... Netherrealm makes some quality, quality fighting game. All right, the roster for the Netherrealm's long-rumored Marvel fighting game has leaked. And dope, dope stuff. According to Reddit user Comic Con Throwaway, Netherrealm Studios creators of the super successful franchise I already told you about, a new fighting game in the Marvel Universe. All right. It's going to be a mixture of popular fighters alongside more obscure picks. And so, bro, this is going to be so dope. I uh, just finished watching Loki, the series Loki. Imagine having Loki in the game. Thor, uh, Guardians of the Galaxy. It's Thanos, bro. Thanos has to be like the final. But now, Thanos ain't even like the ultimate villain. It's that black dude at the end of Loki. He's like the mastermind of everything. <laughs> of the mo whole multi- Oh, I'm spoiling some stuff. <laughs> so, <laughs> I'm not even going to say too much more. But, um, a new fighting game. It's going to be based in the Marvel Universe. Should be lit. You already know. PlayStation's going to probably have Spider-Man exclusive <laughs> to, uh, to their console. But that's cr Black Panther. X-Men, you could put Storm in there. The possibilities. Marvel has my favorite superheroes. I mean, DC has some good ones. Superman, of course. But Marvel, man, that's going to be insane. All right. Next news item. We have to talk about these PlayStation 5 restocks. They're going down this week. That's right. PlayStation 5 restocks are going down. I sort of stopped tracking PS5s, but now that I'm doing this giveaway, like I said, I'm looking for an all-digital PS5 to keep for myself, and a lucky subscriber will be getting my disc version PS5. Um, so you guys are going to get hooked up. But according to TakeRadar.com, PS5 restock um, update. Target, Best Buy, GameStop, all should be dropping this week. And I tell you, bro, I, because I stopped looking for PS5, tracking them, I didn't realize how hard these things are still to get. I mean, I have all the major website pages on refresh all the time, but it's tough. And so, this is when you could expect this week each store to get their restocks. I got you covered, bro. All right. 
There's PS5's restock in the U.S. schedule, schedule for multiple stores, according to our PS5 stock tracker, Matt Swider. Here's who will and won't have consoles this week. All right. So, first one is Target. Um, they're saying Target's next PS5 restock is likely this week, Wednesday or Thursday. So, mark your calendars this week. Wednesday or Thursday for Target and between 7 a.m. and 8 a.m. Eastern. So it's a one hour window. So you got to be ready and be there. All right. Um, um, 7 a.m. and 8 a.m. Usually on Wednesday or Thursday. That's what this article is saying. All right. The next one, Best Buy. Um, they're saying, though, that Best Buy might be a little trickier that the pattern for Best Buy is random. It does weekly stocks, but but then during daylight hours, but after a couple of back-to-back -back cycles, takes off several weeks a time. <coughs> so Best Buy is gonna be restocking, but they're saying it's going to be random. This is what the article says. A Best Buy restock date has happened once a week for four weeks in a row. And that's typical for America's largest electronics focused retailer. However, it does take off several weeks in a row after a few consistent restock events. And so they're pretty much saying Best Buy is going to be unpredictable. All right, the next one, the store you love to hate, GameStop. GameStop, according to this tracker, is saying it's gonna be likely this week, this week. All right, their pattern is week to week and a half with GameStop exclusive PS5 bundles. And so the only thing with GameStop, all right, I'll I tell you what, and I'll share my thoughts. GameStop re restock date is likely this week with the US retailer having been on a consistent pattern, restocking the Sony console every week to week and a half. Today, July 26th, it's been 10 days, so we're likely to see GameStop offer bundles this week. All right, there's several reasons to pay attention to the PS5 consoles for sale at GameStop if you want to buy it immediately. GameStop limits its PS5 stock to bundles. That's the only thing, um, which seems annoying on its face until you realize how many resellers scoop up standalone PS5s at Best Buy, Walmart, Amazon to turn a big profit. It's much harder to turn a profit on a game accessory GameStop card filled bundle. And so the only thing is you're going to have to pay more if you're going through GameStop. Here's another thing you have to keep in mind if you're going through GameStop. The store um, power up pro required. The store has created another barrier to entry by requiring a membership to its power up pro rewards program that costs $15 a year. I have it. So it's no good. <coughs> It's a small price to pay for true gamers who actually want the console for gaming purposes. So uh, we lit, we straight with that. All right. And so Walmart, the next one is Walmart. They're saying their pattern for Walmart is almost always a Thursday, but not every Thursday. All right. Our reporting got this one right days in advance. Walmart was due to have the PS5 disc console in stock, and sure enough, that happened last Thursday at 3 p.m., but they're only doing the, the, right now they're talking about the disc, I want a digital console, and the digital ones are even harder to find. It's been over a month, and we started to receive intel from sources that Walmart had enough inventory to do a restock this past week for everything but PS5 digital, especially after its PS5 restock dis disaster a month prior. All right, so... Walmart will probably just have the digital version. All right, Amazon PS5 restock hasn't dropped PS5 digitals yet. All right, um, pattern once a month, cycle between daytime and nighttime for Amazon. Again, no digital ones. Now this one, this is the one I really wanna pay attention to, Sony Direct PS5 restock. This is the direct store directly from PlayStation. All right. Um, Sony, um, the pattern is twice a month at 5 p.m. Eastern Standard Time, but fairly unpredictable. Um, the last one was Sony PS5 direct date was July 19th. If you had the email invite at 3 p.m. 
if you didn't have the invite you had to wait until 5 p.m so uh, sony direct email invites get sent randomly to registered psn users so that they can buy the console in a special virtual queue that wasn't really part of the process early on more recently it's only been open up a second virtual two to other PSN users all right to press their luck for their console so um, you got to have a PSN uh, you get an email you get first picks if you don't get an email you get the scraps so uh, that's been it for uh, the PS5 restocks I'm still 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 um, trying to uh, get a console an extra PS5 digital so I can keep and I'm gonna do a giveaway for the channel all right, because right now I have two disc ones. I have one for me and one for my kids, so we're good with the disc ones. All right, dudes, what do you guys think about everything we talked about in this video? My kids want to come in, so I'll let them come in. Sound off in the comment section below. I want to know, but before you go, bro, what happened to my... I didn't even change my thing. Click that subscribe button. Stay up to date. All things. Gaming, Gaming. Bro. bro, we, we out. out. Peace. Peace.